Hey everyone, it's been a wild 24 hours in the political world. Chicago is buzzing with energy and not the positive kind. After President Trump's surprising victory, thousands of Chicagoans have taken to the streets in protest. The atmosphere is electric, fueled by frustration, anger, and a deep yearning for change. Now, if you're just tuning in, let me paint the scene for you. Downtown Chicago is packed, Grant Park, The Loop, and even up to the Magnificent Mile. Protest signs, chants, and a sea of people stretching as far as the eye can see. The protesters are diverse. Students, workers, families, all united by a common cause. They're worried about the policies, the rhetoric, and the future of their country under Trump's leadership. And they're making their voices heard loud and clear. Police presence is strong, but the protests have remained largely peaceful. There are moments of tension, of course, but but overall, it's a powerful display of democracy in action. I spoke with a few protesters earlier and their stories are compelling. One woman, a teacher, told me she's worried about her students, especially those from immigrant families. Another, a young man just out of college, said he's scared for his future in the environment. Social media is blowing up with images and videos from the protest. Hashtags like hash not my president and hash Chicago protests are trending with people sharing their experiences and rallying for support. So what's next? Well, it's hard to say. These protests are a sign that people aren't willing to sit back and accept the status quo. They're ready to fight for what they believe in, and Chicago is just the beginning. Stay tuned because this is a story that's far from over. Make sure you're subscribed for more updates and let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Until next time, keep informed and stay engaged. Thanks for watching.